Hi friends, thank you so much for joining me at Home with Susanna and today I will be preparing some faena which is the Spanish version of ratatouille. For this recipe you're going to need eggplant, green pepper, red pepper, zucchini, garlic, onions, crushed tomato, some olive oil and some salt. It's super simple. You don't have to have the, the exact amounts that I will post down below. Um, it's just a marriage of flavors of all those ingredients together so if you have more of one thing and less of another you still will accomplish the dish so don't worry about that and let's get started Solo un rayo del sol, el en el reloj. Hoy mis deudas reciben perdón pago por el show. Feliz porque si no soy yo, pues quién todos caen a mi lado. El freno lo arranqué. Me siento feliz porque I separated the peppers, the onions, and the garlic. In a large pan or wok, we're going to add approximately two to three tablespoons of olive oil. We're going to add salt, about a tablespoon. It's been eight minutes and we're going to add the rest of the ingredients. It's been 15 minutes. And now I'm going to add the tomato sauce. You've got to turn the heat down. I will add this cover so that I don't get the splashes. It's been 30 minutes. And this is ready. Wasn't this a simple recipe? And it doesn't take that long. It smells delicious and it can be served over rice, fish, meat, and my favorite is pasta. I don't serve it over pasta just like this. I actually put it in the blender and I'm telling you, if you serve that over pasta, nobody will guess what's in the sauce but everybody loves it. And I will tell you that from experience. So give that a try. Now I'm gonna try my Sanfaina. It's a marriage of flavors and it is delicious. I ended up adding extra salt to my pan because I had quite a bit of it, but that's completely up to you. Give it a taste. If you feel like it needs more salt, add more salt. But I'm telling you, this is a very nutritious, inexpensive, and easy meal to make. Mm. I hope that you will give it a try. Thank you for joining me. Until next time.